So with Hogwarts Legacy under Horizon, fans are still interested in how the house picking system works in game and while today guys I can bring you confirmation of exactly how this works, what happens if you already signed up to the Wizarding World website and you've had your house picked for you on there via the sorting hat and if you link that to your Warner Brothers account which is tied to your in-game uh, gamer tag, uh, what happens there, well today guys I will explain all. How's it going people? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leave an like, it really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so the four houses within Hogwarts Legacy uh, or the Harry Potter universe themselves, we have Gryffindor, Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff and Slytherin. Now these are houses you will get to pick in game, but exactly how does that work? Well people, I can confirm via information, a legit source actually from poor key game support Warner Brothers website, which I'll link in the video description if you do want to check it out. Uh, but basically guys, what they confirm is if you've already got a house pick for you from the Wizarding World website, which if you haven't already signed up for guys, you probably should go ahead and sign up for it. I mean, if you're curious about what house would be picked for you by the sorting hat, you can go through kind of like a questionnaire, uh, the way in which you think and the way in which you decide things. Uh, you do this via this questionnaire and the sorting hat will pick your way house. Now this house that is picked for you on the Wizarding World website, if you then go ahead and link that uh, Wizarding World website to your Warner Brothers account, which again I'll link that website down below as well, and via your Warner Brothers account people can link your gamer tag to the platform you play on, and then what happens is when a game comes out, the stuff you have picked for you in regards to your wand and your house via the Wizarding World website will be automatically applied to your player in game and this is kind of like a legit way of having a house picked for you the traditional way which is great in my opinion now while this is all good and dandy if, if you don't have a wizarding world account and you ain't really fussed about linking a warner Brothers account to that and to your game a tag this is how it will work in game there will be a ceremony as we see in the gameplay trailers but within the game your house isn't picked for you you actually pick it yourself as they say on this website, which you can see on the screen now, the questions put forth will link in my Hope Art Fan Club account carry over profile data such as my custom wand and Hogwarts house sorting. And they confirm while your sorted Hogwarts house will be your default choice in the game, you can choose to modify your selection before the end of the ceremony. So you can indeed, people modify your selection now what this could mean is actually thinking about it going back on what i said earlier on in the video maybe you go through the ceremony and maybe a house is picked for you in their traditional way maybe there is like a questionnaire in game which you answer and a house is picked for you i don't know maybe one is picked for you at random but either way if you're unhappy with that choice you can modify the selection and choose any house you want gryffindor ravenclaw hufflepuff or slytherin and this is great great news for players i know a lot of people are excited about this and with these houses come companions while well, three or four so far uh, we're still missing that fourth but either way now one thing i will say a benefit of uh signing up to the Wizarding World website and the Warner Brothers account website and linking them all together with your gamer tag is once the game comes out guys you actually get some cosmetic uh, items you receive a beat school mask and house fanatic school robe to use in game and then you can see on screen now so if you do sign up guys these are your rewards but it is completely up to you but yes, the house sorting within Hogwarts Legacy is a big, big deal for many, many players. And it seems as though now in game, you can either way pick the house you want to go with. Even if you have chosen a house within the Wizarding World website, which you ain't happy with. Me personally, I'm probably going to go with Slytherin or Ravenclaw in game. But I always pick Gryffindor on the Wizarding World website. But we will see guys, we will see. But there we have it guys, a little bit of information in regards to house picking within Hogwarts Legacy upon the game's release February 10th. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.